so today I am going to be doing a type of day in the life, I guess. I don't know. I'm not exactly sure how to do them. But I was asked to do them, so we're leaving the house today, so I figured why not. Um, I do have some running around to do. I, I have to go to that. I have to go to Kroger to get my father-in-law a gift card. His birthday is on Memorial Day. I need to drop off my hubby's prescription. I'll tell you about that in a second. And then we are going to hang out with my hubby while he is at work for the day. He is taking a break from truck driving and he is going back into his carpentry type work, um, construction type work. He is actually building a what is it called laser a laser tag um room and yesterday mind you the building we're going to i'll show you um nobody's there because it's closed down for the holiday weekend so he was there by himself yesterday and he was using his grinder and it got out of control and he got himself in the face his finger in his chest so he ended up having to go to the hospital yesterday to get stitches and of course he's a man he went straight back to work so I don't necessarily want him there by himself anymore so we're gonna go hang out with him for a little bit um, but the first thing I am going to do is go drop off his antibiotic prescription and I got all three kiddos with me hi. Hi. Baby Yoda. Ariana's not saying hi but all right Baby let's go have dropped off the prescription and I think that's all we've really done so far now I am at my hubby's work we picked up McDonald's which I hate McDonald's every single time I go they mess up my order they forget a ton of food I hate them and I hate their food I love um they love McDonald's so um and so does my hubby so that is what we are having for lunch um my favorite thing that I do enjoy from McDonald's is the mocha frappes and I get no whip um, no whipped cream or chocolate drizzle on mine I just like the actual drink so but all right we're gonna go in and eat lunch and then the kids are probably gonna go skating around I'll show you the building it's actually really cool um, I'm going to school it's like a sports school. building got, it also has a bar upstairs um, but it has a bowling alley um, my husband a couple years ago built so a axe throwing thing in there um, I, there's a lot of stuff in there. It's pretty cool. But building all right. Laser tag. Yep. Now he's building the laser tag. So, all right, we're gonna go in. So this is just my hubby working. I did plan on showing you like the whole area he's doing, but right now you only see this room because the rest of it was all blocked off, and um, because it's not safe for the children. So I'm not able to show you that, but I will show you a little bit of other things he has done here. Yale yeah, made this a couple years ago. It's the axe throwing. Pretty cool. He's really good at what he does. No drinks in here, come on. I don't want him spilling it. Try to make it. Good 
Good job, Kayla. Oh yeah, you're gonna try to make it from all the way over here. Baby L, don't step on it. No bug, you don't keep him on the board. Because it's part of the game. You Right here, I had to turn off the sound because you'll notice my son, he's going to start to cover his ears. My husband started using the saw, so or the grinder, or whatever tool he was using at the time. And it was super loud, so I had to turn off the volume. But that's why he's covering his ears, too, just to let you guys know. I forgot to record when we were leaving his work, but we did leave, and I went and picked up his prescription. Now we are at Kroger, so we're going to go in there. I'm not going to record in there because they, don't let it, you. Well, they do let us, but it is crazy packed, and I am so weird about recording in public. It's just weird, but all right, well, let's go in and see what we can find. I'll get You ready? Yeah. 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 Oh, oh, oh. They're ready. Baby O, come here, please. So we made it home from Kroger. Um, you only seen like the flowers, a tiny bit of like not even flowers, they were vegetables. Um, my son was horrible in the store. He is every time we go. So even if we wanted to record, that wasn't an option. But I only got very 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 little there anyway but i'm going to show you guys what i got now i got two ribeye steaks for my hubby and my oldest daughter that's what they want for dinner i got a cucumber plant strawberries um the gift card for my father-in-law bacon for my beans and i think i'm actually going to I'm not making them until the morning because they're for our barbecue tomorrow, but I think I'm going to add that into this video because they are so good and it's so easy to make. I use um, Bush's baked beans and then I add, um, sometimes I add hamburger meat. I'm not going to this time because where I'm going, they prefer just the bacon, but I add bacon, brown sugar, ketchup, mustard, onions. I don't know. You'll have to watch me do it, but they're so delicious. And me and my two other kids are going to have chicken for dinner. And then I stopped at Tim Hortons. The kid got donuts, and I got a ice cap. So that is all I got. So this is what you're going to need for the beans. Ketchup, mustard, Bush's baked beans. It doesn't matter what kind. I already grinded up the bacon, onion, and brown sugar. And then you will pour it into a dish that you're going to be baking it in. I always start with the beans because it makes more sense. And yes, I did drop the can. Um, and then you just pour everything else in with it, mix it together. And 
usually what I do is I cook it all the way here like all the way through when I'm at home but since I have to rewarm it there I'm only going to put it in the oven for 20 minutes at 375 I do add my brown sugar but when I got there I did add more brown sugar on the top and then I warmed it up so it kind of makes the top of it like almost caramelized and it is so good so easy to make and if you don't want a sweet version because I use the brown sugar. You could also put a little bit of brown sugar in it. But put peppers and stuff like that in it too. And it's just. It's so good. It's it's an easy way to spice up your beans. If you will. And it's one of our family favorites. My mom does make it so much better than me. And so does my sister. Because it was actually a recipe my grandma came up with. I mean. And she's not here anymore. And they're known as my grandma's baked beans. That's what we call them. But. If you guys like baked beans, give it a try. I promise you will not regret it. Now I'm just going to go ahead and mix everything together, like I said, and then stick it in the oven at 350 for this time I cooked it for 20 minutes. But if you're cooking it straight through and you don't need to warm them up for later, I would put them on for about 30, 35 minutes or until the, the top is a little caramelized. But that's it simple easy peasy lemon squeezy and I promise you guys will love them and this is what they looked like after being in the oven for 20 minutes um, and then when I got to my sister-in-law's house like I said before I added a little bit more brown sugar and I cooked them and they were caramelized and I want to give a very special shout out to my father-in-law today is his birthday Memorial Day I have the best in-laws in the world I got blessed unfortunately my mother-in-law did pass away but we still have him left and he's a big part of our family happy birthday papa we love you